My name is Andrew Ryan, and I'm here to ask you a question. Why is there so much shit in my butt? Is a man not entitled to the shit of his butt? No, says the Vatican. It belongs to God. No, says Toilet Chan. It belongs in my tum tum. Toilet Chan craves turds, you see. I rejected those answers. Instead, I chose the impossible. The unpoopable, even. I chose Rapture. And with the shit of your butt, Rapture can become your shitty, too. Do I still have my... Yes, I do. I wonder if I ever get to use that to kill one of the monsters. That would make a cool... I've never seen that happen in a horror movie. Like, instead of running in fear from the... From the grody monster, somebody just straight straight up fucking kills it, takes an axe and, and hacks it to pieces, and, the, and then the movie's over. That's it. Everybody lives. Credits roll. Hello. Hello. Why is there so much shit in my butt? Well, Hi. he doesn't know either. It's a fucking wizard mystery. Oh, whoa! 45 degree angles. This is some high tech shit. What's that? Oh, that's my footsteps. I'm on metal, aren't I? Okay, I'm stupid. I thought something was pounding on the door. Larger, yeah, it has a larger budget. They can afford 45 degree angles now. This is cool. They're, go they're doing a sci-fi themed area now. I just I just watched Aliens, which is fucking badass. James Cameron's a genius. Oh no! Waste high crates. I can't possibly get past those. I have to go the other way. Huh. More waste high crates. Nobody can get past these. It's impossible. I have to go the other way. I have to. This is this is cool. This is reminding me of like a Halo 1 with these floating interfaces. What's projecting them? They're just kind of there. Ah! Ah! Rape Dar is going off. It's going off. No music yet. Why don't I just make a barrier out of these crates? The monster can't get past it either. Oh, that looks promising. Why don't I go in there? What's the worst that could happen? Okay. I'm a dumb motherfucker. What? Literally what? Why is there spaghetti here? Can I... Okay, I can. Ah, shit! What the fuck are you? What are you? Are you gonna fucking rape my pooper later? I'm not... Keep taking my eyes off you. You want some of this? Yeah, that's what I thought. Can 
Okay. Something to do with the power outages? Do I need to keep track of that? I am the axe man. Oh! I am the axe man. Oh! Can I use this for anything else? Is this is this just for clearing blockages or can I attack? Can I ask people a question with it? <laughs> uh, keep it close. Some something else. So, okay. All right. So I have to. I have to lead it. I have to keep it within a certain distance from me. Otherwise, it's gonna metamorphose. It's gonna fucking go Super Saiyan. If I, if I let it get far away. Oh. Oh. Ah! Uh, how did it do that? How did it fucking go through the... Oh, it's so fucking gross. Oh. Oh, it's like a fat woman's pussy. I think I'll call you Her Majesty's Secret Service. That is a vag I would not give the Secret Service to, if you know what I mean. You don't? Me either, actually. Uh, it's a really gross design. It's one of the 3D ones. I don't remember what this looked like before. Oh, I'm in one of the purple rooms. From the, the purple Tetris map earlier. Oh, oh. Nice try. Almost bamboozled me. But I'm the master ruse man here. <laughs> Can I? I wish I could knock him into that. I wish there was a way to fight any of these monsters. It's frustrating because it becomes less frightening to run from them after you've seen the same one a couple times. You had that coming. After you've seen the same one a couple times, you just want to kill it. Who's bad? I'm bad. At relationships. I have no time for you. I wish I did. This is not a happy fun time. This is a scary run time, okay? And there should be different games in each of those these rooms. I know that's extra work, but that would be really cool. Six twenty-four. Okay, so love is over. So I get to save again at six fifty, right? I think it saves every fifty rooms. Cause I do not want to redo that. I hope they're cute too. Maybe I can seduce the final boss with my saucy boy moves. I mean, my grandma thinks I'm handsome. <coughs> Is there something behind me? You motherfuckers. I'm so fucking paranoid. This is not a cozy game. It was to begin with, but is not now. Th my smile is gone from my face forever. My coziness has been destroyed.
No longer will I rap of happiness. Instead, I will only rap sad, mournful raps. I've been here. This is this lazy. How much of this is deliberately set up and how much of it is randomly generated? Oh, centipede again. Ah. That one actually got me. It set me up to be scared of the fucking centipede. I hear it. I can hear it coming. Uh, no. No! Nope, 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 nope. Shrek, where are you when I need you? Ah! How did I fall for that again? Three times I fell for that. It's still here, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Uh... Ah! Oh, man. This is not good for my fucking blood pressure. I'm squeezing out a butt nugget. Mm, this one, I think. Oh, it didn't matter. I came so far, and I tried so hard, but in the end, it didn't even matter. It didn't even matter. Oh, that would be another bomb-ass mod for this. A Shrek mod? Where it starts playing Smash Mouth's All-Stars, and Shrek chases you? And if he catches you, you have to take his ogre load. You know what they said, donkey. Ogre balls are like onions. Just, just roughly the same size, I mean. That's all there is to that analogy. Oh, that one actually worked that time. Wasn't that one of the f real fake doors before? Like on Rick and Morty? This place is full of real fake doors. This is a weird room. It's got pictures of what I assume are the developers in it. And this guy's literally like 15. I don't know what he did. Those purple rooms are the key, I'm sure of it. I'm past 650 and there's no save room yet. Okay, straight. Straight. Left. Okay, straight. 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 Three straights. Okay, straight, 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 right. This has got to be connected to the purple rooms, right? I'm not fucking crazy. <coughs> Is it the same shape? I can't tell. 58. Do I have to wait until 700? I have to wait until fucking 700, don't I? Oh, static. Static rape dart going off. Butthole clenching. Butthole clenched. Status of butthole is now 100% clenched. That escalated quickly. I've, I've been here. I think I just have to go through here a lot. This is a reference to PT. I, I'm... I'm Everything in this game, this is like Duke Nukem, everything's a reference to something else. Oh shit! 
That oh, I that happened before and I still wasn't ready. Um ready to die. Now there is no more shit in my butt. Again? Again? Come on. Come on. Can I go back? Do I have to go back? There's nothing back here. I'm spooked. What the fuck? George is getting angry. Okay. Uh, different background, ambient sound. Different monster, I assume? I think each monster has an ambient sound and a chase theme. It's my hypothesis. Fuck, Aliens is such a good movie, though. That was one of those movies where they're like, no way can there be a sequel to Alien that's actually better than it. But it was better in every way. Like, a single alien is Xenomorph is scary. But seeing them all together in groups, like, just swarming, crawling all over each other is a special kind of nightmarish. And seeing them in their element, because you, you didn't get to see a hive in the first alien. Like, when they saw a hive for the first time, they're like, what the fuck is this shit? What is this made out of? It gave them an opportunity to explore more of, of Geiger's aesthetic when they designed the hive. Because the only only Geiger inspiration in the original film was the alien ship, the eggs, and the xenomorph. Whereas you really got to see a whole environment that was made out of fucked up xenomorph shit in, in the second film. And there's so many connections I didn't make as a kid watching it. Yes, I was allowed to watch that as a kid. Probably that is why I am like this now. You and I are through. Pack up your fucking pogs and get them out of my apartment. Except for your Alf Slammer. That's mine. We agreed on that. You just don't remember it. You gotta remember pogs. We were such stupid fucking kids to buy cardboard circles with pictures on them. And metal, metal discs that we would throw down at stacks of... Those fucking things. Uh, oh, it's that guy. Oh, I. Oh, no! Oh, I, I get another chance. I get another chance. If I fuck up, I can let him get close again while I heal, and he transforms back into the, into the vagina monster. Just like actual vaginas, according to my best understanding of female anatomy. I love how he just kicks down the fucking door. Corey's in the house, bitches. It's goofy time! No, Dad, no! Oh, shit! I went a little too fast last time. I believe I go this way? No, I don't think so. I think I go this way.
This is tedious. This whole- why am I complaining about that? This whole game is tedious. It's just going through rooms. Could that be a metaphor for life? The answer is no, it isn't. I still kind of want to stick it in there. I wouldn't even have to be that drunk. If I don't get my dick back, it's not a big deal. It's not like I use it anyway. Except for when I draw a T-Rex face on it and make it fight my balls in the bathtub. Which I assume everybody does that. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. Six eighty eight. I'm almost there. Almost there. I thought you already ran out of water. I thought you were drinking ink. Am I gonna meet that guy? Is that guy is that dude the final boss? That would blow my fucking mind. Even more than when I found out that you could wear a hoodie backwards and put popcorn in the hood. And then you'd have it like a sort of a feed bag of popcorn at all times while you're watching a movie. I'm just paying it forward, paying that knowledge on to you. That's what you get. That's what you get. I'm almost there. If it fucks me in the last couple rooms, I'm gonna re so hard like you have never heard anybody re before. Uh, 95. Maybe there will be another sexy skeleton waiting for me in the, in the next elevator church. Which is a sentence that I didn't really anticipate saying out loud when I got up this morning. Which are the wonders of virtual reality, this new medium of our modern age. Oh, I made it. And that's all you fucking get for today. I guess I have to actually say I would like you to like and subscribe. Because I've put out a shitload of videos now. My subscribers have been frozen at 498. Basically, since I started, I don't like to do it. It sounds desperate. It's why I haven't done it until now, but I see now why other YouTubers do that. So please like and subscribe. Um, if you meet me someday, I can give you a quick back alley handy or something. To, you know, just a little thank you. And I, I'll reveal to you, as a special bonus, why there's so much shit in my butt. Or your butt, for that matter. Any of our butts.